was on Facebook. When it caught my eye about her, I seen that she was a rider. And after the Facebook, I gave her my number. Like, we was texting on and off. After that, I ran into her in person. I was downtown at the McDonald's. And I just heard somebody call my name. I'm like, who are they? And he was like, this Jerry, man. He had the biggest smile. Then it went from there. My life changed for the better I've been with her for a, a lot of reasons, because mainly, I probably wouldn't even be here to this day if it probably went for her. Especially the moment, like, like kids, situations. He's a great father. He's a great dad overall. Like, he's active in school, whatever, sports, whatever my kids have, he, he's an active dad. Some of the qualities I do want my kids to have that they mother got, she very clean and she very strong minded so you can't distract her on what she want to do or what she plan on doing with a goal or something and another thing is like when it comes to business she not to handle it she not to stand on it What I want to see in my kids' relationship, that's in my relationship, family value. Be big on family. Know that family is everything. And almost so the family that I created is my everything. So I want to see that in my kids. Fit together with their siblings and know that we are we got. Brooks family gets the world. my life is when I got fired from my job and I seen how how much it cared to her to me to get another job and then I didn't have no job. So in the big of an eye, she got me a job then the same week I got fired. And after that, by her by her helping me get that job, I, I wouldn't mind giving her my check every week. So hey, the moment I knew that I wanted Jeremy in my life forever was when I first met Jeremy, I had two kids. My oldest son was two, I think, and I met him when my baby was just like two months. And you couldn't tell him that that wasn't his child. She went everywhere with him. Like, that was his everything before we even had kids. So by him, like, taking my kids in and just Living on them like that, I knew that I wanted him in my life forever. I knew that somebody I can grow with. And it wasn't no stepdad, no none of that. He told them, these are my kids. What I miss most about Demetri while she's gone is her comfort. She is my reminder. So it's like, if I forget something, she's on top of it. Time is more special when she's around. I never met nobody that like, would go to bat for me, like how hard Jeremy go for me. Like, supporter-wise, Jeremy support anything I do. He don't care whether it is, he support anything I do. Well, we mainly like the, me and my wife mainly like the, you know, travel a lot. But as far as traveling-wise, you know, the little local stuff, like, Going out to dinner, watching movies. Jeremy taught me how to cook. When I first met Jeremy, I did not know how to cook. I ate out every day. My mom used to have to come cook for me. Jeremy taught me how to cook. The first thing Jeremy taught me how to cook was pork chops. And I've been cooking ever since then. What my dad would think about me getting married, I feel like he would love for me to get married. I feel like that's every dad's wish is to give their daughter away. My dad was big on family, and so that he would love that because Jeremy big on family. And like, in some ways, I see a lot of my dad and Jeremy, like, family-wise, like, taking care of his kids. So I think that he would love, he would like Jeremy. Thank you. And I know that he would love for his baby girl to be married. I do wish that he can be here, but it's unfortunate, so yeah. Well, I'm giving my wife a message that uh, I think we are moving better towards our 
goal as in family wise. I know like this is what we both want. The message I want to give to Jeremy is you my everything. You complete me. I love you so much. Like, um, I know you had asked me this like 20 times and I finally said yes and let you make me your wife. But I just think the time was right now and that I love you and we're in a whole better space now. So like, it was definitely the right time. I'm ready to see what this next chapter holds for us.